What's up? Sick, Ermac. And I didn't mean sick like, yo, I'm so sick. As in cool. I mean sick like I'm actually sick. With that being said, let's get into this shit. Let's get into How about y'all having a good ass day? I lowered the fuck out of this game's audio. This shit's loud as fuck. And this shit just wants to... MK Deception specifically? You got Deadly Alliance Deception or to get him. Deception's the loudest one that just wants to fucking scream at you. That being said, we're playing my boy Baraka. Baraka. This costume would have been more sick if it looked closer to MK2. But that's just my opinion. With that being said, I'm gonna cut out my commentary because, yeah, I'm gonna be coughing and shit. Round one fight. Round one, fight!
Round one, fight! Round one, fight! <laughs> Round one, fight! Ha! <laughs> 
Round one, fight! <laughs> If you guys like that video, rate, comment, and subscribe. Much appreciated. Peace out, guys. Baraka assumed that the treacherous Melena had given her armies a powerful magic. They fought with savage brutality, but he could not stop their advance. He vowed that Melina would pay for her betrayal. Baraka's warriors brought word that she had agreed to meet with him in an ancient lair, but Baraka was no fool. He sent another in his place. Baraka's scouts reported that the Earthrealm warrior Sub-Zero was near. He allowed his remaining militia to deal with him and set off alone to ambush Melina. He knew by the scent of Tarkatan blood on her clothes that she had already killed the one he had sent to meet her. But her sense of smell was not as keen as a true Tarkata's. She was unaware of Baraka's presence. He barked her name, and when she turned to face him, he tore her apart.